following Donna Marco's shady remark regarding Melissa Gorga's sister-in-law Teresa Giudice, which Donna later removed, fans are responding to Donna Marco. Melissa anticipated that Donna would extend an invitation to Teresa's wedding to Luis Arruelas in 2022. Despite Donna's history of inflammatory remarks against Teresa expressed on the internet, Melissa got really angry when she didn't. Joe Gorga, Melissa's spouse and a frequent guest on Real Housewives of New Jersey, has cut off communication with his sister Teresa. A screenshot was taken by a user prior to Donna erasing the comment due to outrage from fans. A video showed Teresa pouring tequila down a man's throat was being commented on by Donna, who was standing behind a bar. According to the user that posted the picture, this is the reason you were not invited to the wedding. Another said that Joe Gorga created the art of pouring liquor, citing Melissa's family. Although her daughter has been imitating Teresa for 20 years, she did write a third fan. A fourth remarked, that's where Melissa gets the petty jealousy to keep it going. Teresa has moved on from them. How unflattering. She started blocking individuals on a whim, expressing a fifth of those who said anything for which she ought to have kept her mouth shut. In one post, several followers did defend Donna, saying, those are very rude comments to a 75-year-old sad. And for Teresa to have been such a strong sister and aunt, said someone else. What does she say to their aunt behind Zia Melissa's back? Such girls have much too much knowledge. Although there have been rumors that the Real Housewives of New Jersey might not return at all, the show is presently on break. Fans of Teresa, who began the program as an original cast member in 2009, believe Melissa and Margaret Josephs are attempting to remove her. Melania wrote about her decision-making process in March 2024 when she decided to go to college at the University of Tampa. I have come to detest the cold, to be honest. Back then, she said, I'm so over the cold weather. In addition, I did not take the SAT or any other test. I detest taking tests, I am not a test taker, and I do not enjoy them. Knowing that I got outstanding marks, I decided to enroll in institutions that do not need tests. I'm so over the winter that I knew I wanted warm weather. All I wanted was to be near a beach. The native of New Jersey continued by saying that another reason for her choice was Tampa's proximity to Nassau, Bahamas, the home of her father, Joe Giudice. I gave it a lot of thinking, as in, wait a minute. My dad is 30 minutes flight from Florida. That is very incredible. I will thus visit my dad anytime I get a few days off from school or anything like. It's going to be amazing. 